Okay, now that I have everything moved, the book that I want into the original folder, these are just templates. I never record or save into these. These just help me. And so as you do each book, you can throw them away. So let's do the title. So first thing I do is I right click, go open with, and I have Audacity. If I don't have Audacity in this area here, choose default program. And Audacity most likely will not be up here then if you don't have it. I have it because I set my default to it. Hit Browse. And you'll go under Program Files and you'll find Audacity. It's nice. It's at the very top. And you'll find Audacity EXE. Double click on that. And I click Always Use This Selected Program to Open This Kind of File, which is a MP3. So all MP3s now will open Audacity for me. Now that Audacity is open, I can go in and you can see right here, English 01 Gen 00 Title. If I went into Audacity, open Audacity and told it to import this, it wouldn't have all this information and the meta information doesn't work as well. So if you open it from the MP3, this information comes in better. So I'm going to record. I'm going to double click on that. I'm going to delete it. I'm going to record Genesis. I, I'm not going to edit it here. What I'm going to do is take it, save project as. Yes, I want it as AUP. And you'll see here's my Audacity folder. The information is correct here. Hit save. Now I want to export. Go down to export, control shift E. I want to export this as a wave. I don't want to go into that folder. I want it to go into my wave folder. This information is correct because I opened it from my template. Um, options, there's no options to change. If I hit save, if you notice, the metadata is in here because we changed it in Windows. The English is correct. Genesis, the track is zero. And if you want to change any of this information, you can watch my um, lesson on how to save metadata information. I close that. When I get done, I actually close Audacity and I go to the next one. I right click on it. Oh, I don't even have to right click because I set the default. I can double click on it. Now that Audacity opens, you can see it's correct. English 01 Gen 01. I want to go File, Save Project As. Yes, AUP. I'll go to my Audacity folder. Say yes. Double click, delete this. I'm going to record Genesis Chapter 1. Okay, I'm going to record more. 1, blah, 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 blah. 10, blah, 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 blah. So I recorded that file and I'm not going to edit it. Uh, and I'm going to take it and I'm going to save it. So I'm going to go to File, Save Project. And I won't ask you because I've already saved it. And now I'm going to export a wave. And so I'm going to go into my wave folder. Yes, it shows the right folder there. Hit Save. The information is correct. I close this down, go to the next book, and continue on. Like I said, if you wanted to, after you recorded it, you can take them, and I did this one, and this one, you can delete it, so that you've known you've already done it, and you can continue on to the next one.